Okay, today I'm going to put some speakers in 1975 Volkswagen transporter bus and I'm going to install them here. First thing you want to do is take your door card off. It's a good idea to use some trim removers. Uh, it makes it a lot easier to pop those out without damaging your door card. And then the next thing I'm going to do is remove that plastic from that area and make a cardboard template for my sheet metal. Okay, so plastic's gone. I'm going to take some cardboard here, get myself a template so that I can trace it onto my sheet metal. Alright, so here's my sheet metal. Grab myself a marker. And I'll cut this out. I'm going to leave myself a little bit extra so that I can fine tune it to fit into the space. Just some 26 gauge sheet metal I had laying around. Alright, so there's my rough, and then we'll fine tune it from there. Alright, so the speakers I'm using don't have the cardboard template because they are used. Uh, if you had that, it'd be easy to trace your outline but fit it and I think this is where I want it so I'm going to draw the outer circle and then I'm going to measure in and draw distance here so there's something for the speaker to attach to and that's the part I'll cut out. Okay well since I couldn't find my compass I had to improvise and found a uh, smoke detector ring for mounting it that I think will give me the right distance that I need. So I'm going to trace this on here and then I'm going to cut this hole out. Alright, I'm going to use some curb snips. And that's going to fit beautifully. So it gives me strong mounting points to mount my speaker. Fits in there nicely and it should be nice and sturdy. Okay, so I'm going to prep this area, remove the paint so that I can weld that into place. Make sure you're wearing some good safety goggles. Keep your eyes from getting all foobarred. Okay, area's all prepped up. Paint's removed. I'm going to tack this into place. Always a good idea to wear flip flops when you're welding. Okay, so unfortunately my battery died for the welding, but welded it in and then just kind of filled the area with Bondo. And I'm going to give it a quick 
quick coat of paint keep everything from rusting and then I'll drill in the speaker or the holes for the speaker mount and it'll be good to go okay so everything is back together yes I realized the door card is not on but I have new ones on order they're just not going to be here for a couple months uh, but speakers in it is firm and it is not going to fall out solid so hope this gives some people some ideas and uh, if you like what you've seen be sure to like and subscribe thanks for watching